Well, hello again, this time face to face. And uh, at this point in your business, you should have probably already gone through the orientation recording, which talked about options for how you get your business started. You've also worked on your wedding list of who the people are in your life that you would invite if you were going to have a big wedding this summer, uh, who those relationships are. The average big wedding invites about 150 families. Um, and so hopefully you've been working on that and you've gotten a chance to put a sign or symbol by each of those names in those four areas and are working with me on those so you can beat the box and uh, looking at dates for your beauty bash to kick things off for your business and get you going um, with strength. And so what I want to talk about now is a little bit more of the details of what to be working on and kind of share some things with you. So grab your orientation packet. Uh, if you don't have it, you definitely need it for this recording or it won't make much sense. <laughs> so definitely grab that. And uh, if you don't have it, there is one on JessMitchell.org. Um, under the new consultants page, you can print the new consultant packet and follow along. And so the first couple pages are just fun info. Let's go to page three where you see checklist number one. And this stuff we've already been working on. It should be pretty much good to go. You should be underway with it. Um, the orientation, the beauty bash, and all of that. And then there's a few details at the bottom, little things to do just to make sure that you get in the system with our unit so you get recognition as necessary and you get information as it comes out. Um, let's go to page four, checklist number two. And again, more details with Beat the Box and your Beauty Bash. And there are two wonderful resources for prepping for your uh, Beauty Bash. And that is a Voxer message recording and a document that you get in your email. So double check that you have gotten those if you do have a date set for the Bash. Um, and uh, continue to work on those Beat the Box names uh, for that training. And then what I want to talk about is the additional things in this list. We're going to start here. So under the checklist to additional things, the first one you'll see there is check out MaryKayInTouch.com to register for some limited time offers. There are some awesome uh, benefits and perks for you as a new consultant. So definitely check those out. You have, um, when you log in to Mary Kay in Touch, there's a place that just talks about early offers or next steps and there's some time sensitive things there um, if you want to set up your own personal website I highly recommend it it is very inexpensive and very effective and wonderful thing to have um, of course all the discounts for product orders as well as getting uh, business cards and labels and stamps and just things that you can pick from to put the best foot forward for yourself and your business. It's all up to you, all discretionary, but we want to make sure that you don't miss those opportunities while they're cheaper and um, are able to plug into as much as possible, set yourself up strong. Um, and then underneath that, attend your first success meeting. I'm going to talk a little bit about these meetings, what they are and where. Our unit is very spread. We are all over the United States, and so there's no way that we can weekly come together as a family. We do that more virtually and we do that once a year at our summer seminar. But for most weeks we have a meeting here in Longview, Texas where I live and then we have meetings that are going on in Ohio. And then if you don't live in one of those two states we plug you in with a director who will love on you and support you and give you hands-on training all over the United States. So if you live outside of that Dayton, Columbus area of Ohio or outside of the Longview area and we haven't set you up with a meeting you can go to and a director to get plugged in with, please let me know. Please contact me about that as soon as you can. And you'll be in our unit always. We'll take care of you and love on you, but there are opportunities for you to plug in locally. Um, if you do live in that region of Ohio or Texas, then there are meetings you can go to um, all throughout those areas. And so um, on my website, under the, the calendar tab, jessmitchell.org, O-R-G. Uh, the calendar tab has the meeting locations and times, so you can plug into the one that best suits you. Um, for Longview, we meet on Tuesday evenings at 7.30 p.m., and um, I can give you all the details on that, but for any Mary Kay meeting, just to kind of give you the basic ropes, no matter who you meet with, you will always want to come in a skirt or dress in Mary Kay attire. We don't have a ton of roles here in Mary Kay, but one thing we do to honor our founder is dress a step above the norm whenever we're working our Mary Kay 
business. So if you're doing an appointment, you're doing a listen for lip gloss coffee date, you're going to a training or a meeting, unless we specifically say wear something different, always know you'll throw on a skirt or dress. It can be any color, style, shape. Um, we're not too picky about that. Just something that's professional with professional um, look to go with it so you present yourself well and you kind of look the part of a beauty consultant. Um, so you're going to want to do that. If you can, at all possible, always take guests with you. Friends, family, new customers, people that you know, you're know you meeting in your life to come because we always do product. We always give you a chance to try things hands first, hands on. So you can utilize your guests to do a facial and to try the product on. You also get a chance to uh, see if they're interested in being a client of yours. Maybe they want to purchase something or book a party or even join you in your endeavor. It's just smart to bring a guest or two or three every single week that you can. And we talk more about that, but I just want to throw that out to you. Be sure to bring someone. And um, for your first meeting, bring your most supportive friend so she can take pictures and cheer you on as you get pinned and welcomed into our family. Um, some meetings will have a very small door charge simply to help cover the cost of the location. Um, so you'll find out about that. And then if you do have guests, bring your starter kit and your samples, anything that you have because you'll need the mirror and the tray and the different products to demo and then anything you don't have the director at that meeting will cover for you and make sure to you know support you in that so um, don't worry about it come get plugged in I do find that the girls who get plugged into the meeting quickly and pretty consistently really build the deepest connections and they tend to feel the most like um, in the swing of things they get to build friendships and you feel supported and you grow a lot faster so I know life happens and it's definitely not an attendance policy, but it's a great way to be sure that you're going to be successful quickly and have a place to come and kind of just be with like-minded people. Most people hardly know what Mary Kay is, much less how to build a successful business in it. And we all have our ups and downs. We have our struggles. And so we want it to be a place where you can come and be shoulder to shoulder with like-minded women who love you and are in the trenches with you. Um, and that's what our success meetings are about. You'll get hands-on product, you'll get encouragement, you'll get business tips, and um, even just leave a little more inspired and motivated to do what you wanna do with your business. So definitely check out the success meeting. Next, set up your communication systems. I'll just be honest, you guys, communication is everything, and I'm sure you all know that. If we don't have communication back and forth in any relationship, the relationship dies. And so, same for me. Because our unit is so large and there's a lot of people that I work with, I depend on you to reach up. Please reach up. You are my job, um, and I want to invest time in supporting you and your business, as well as the woman who brought you into Mary Kay. We're here for you, so please don't feel like you have to be alone. Um, and some great ways to do that would be through the phone, through texting and calling, email, text, Facebook, utilize the method that works best for you, but reach out often. I love to hear from you. And so you can join our Facebook group. You can become a part of our Voxer group and uh, just be in with what we're doing as a unit and as a team. Um, be sure you have voicemail set up on your phone. It's hard for a customer to leave an order if you don't have voicemail. <laughs> and uh, additionally, if somebody you call doesn't pick up and they're calling you back, they don't know who you are, and it's just not a very professional situation if they can't leave a message. So be sure you have that, and be sure that you're looking at your email daily just so you don't miss something that's coming out and that's up and current. Uh, and then lastly, under this checklist would be to check out the Ways to Win brochure. It's in this orientation packet and it just talks about stuff for new girls that can just be little perks along the way as you get started. Very easy steps you can take, but we want to kind of guide you to going to the right place because I know there's a lot of information and you came to Mary Kay to win, to be successful in different arenas. And so um, we want to provide a way that you know you're winning. And that's what the Ways to Win brochure is. It's just steps to take to make sure that you're getting your feet under you and then you get little benefits along the way because you're taking steps and you're building your business. And so check that brochure out for sure. Okay, let's go to the next page. Checklist number three. After your starter kit arrives, you'll definitely want to open it up, look at the papers, play with everything. You can throw away the boxes from what your products are in and 
put those in the little mesh bags and just have fun. Kind of start to get a feel for what's in there. Start to mess around with some organization and, uh, and just have fun with that. There's a welcome DVD. There's all kinds of material in there as well as a place on JessMitchell.org that talks about preparing for your first party. That's under the New Consultants page. There's a ton of resources at the New Consultants page. So just go there as often as you can and check out those resources so you feel prepared for these steps. Um, there's also, this is the New Consultant Orientation Part 2, so check, you're doing that, great job. And from here, you can set up a binder or a notebook that has a place for the three major sections of things you'll be working on. Um, and you can begin the new consultant training classes. And those classes are also at jessmitchell.org under the new consultants page tab. And you'll see videos and, and documents that you can print off to follow along with those videos. So you do not have to do all the videos in a week. You don't even have to do them all in a month. Just begin and start to move through, and they are very basic but really good ideas and suggestions on proven ways that Mary Kay can, uh, that you can get your Mary Kay business off to a great start. As you go, you'll have the joy of mastery, where you kind of own the skills and you figure them out, and then you can tweak them, you can adjust them. Mary Kay is not a like you have to be in a certain mold company or business, but what the videos are for is to give you a groundwork, to give you somewhere to start, to imitate, for example, the leaders that we have and the skip skills and techniques that we do, so that you can make them your own and launch them from there. So enjoy those videos and kind of make your way through those. And once you get done, there is a prize you earn just as a congrats for getting through them and for uh, learning all that you're gonna learn in those classes. And you're welcome to go back and review anytime. Um, next, review the previous checklists. <laughs> Just go back and see, is there anything I missed? Anything that slipped? Uh, we give you uh, dates and deadlines, but hey, if you miss a certain expiration, go back and catch it later. It's not a big deal. We just want you to succeed. Um, and then finalize your inventory decision. If you don't have the funding in place, if you haven't made a decision on that, be sure to um, finalize that before the windows and expiration dates happen because you don't want to miss out. Um, checklist number four, getting started. From here, you're going to continue preparing for your beauty bash and um, really getting the word out. Honestly, the biggest part of your job is getting the word out, getting people there. If you get people there, the people who are doing your bash for you, whether it's myself or your recruiter or whoever, they'll do most of the work that day. It's just having a wonderful group of women there to join you. So work on that, finish up your videos. I highly recommend observing a few parties with myself and or your recruiter, just go watch. You learn so much by seeing how it happens in the moment, the questions people ask, the way we handle ourselves. I tell you, you could build your confidence faster than anything just by doing that. So we invite you to come with us, get our schedules and come, come along, and then um, go through that preparing for your first party information. Once you uh, launch, you're gonna be holding parties and you may already have some on your books. So go through that material and soak that in. And then there's a great focus folder that I give to consultants so you know what to keep track of and you kind of can keep your Mary Kay brain in one place. That's why we do the binder, the three ring binder or notebook and a focus folder because there's a lot of details with a business like this, but it really isn't complex. It's very, very simple. Just a few simple things that you can get in place where all of your brain can go down on paper for your business and you can pick it up when it's time to do Mary Kay and put it down and not think about it when it's time to do other important things in your life. So um, definitely uh, make sure to get a focus folder. And if you don't know what that is, contact me and I'll help you out. Next page of the orientation packet is the ways to win. So there's all the fun benefits you get as you go, as you learn and kind of take some steps. Uh, the next few pages is a spot for your wedding list. You've probably already been working on that, so continue to add to that ongoing. It's never too late to put someone on there. Um, and then the next page is a page that just shows a picture of me and my family and tells you a little bit about us. 
Um, and then the following page, page 10, is kind of the overview of the new consultant training classes. What are they covering? So you kind of have an idea going into it, what you're going to learn, and you can even check off when you've accomplished those classes um, or if you want to go back and review. So that's new consultant training. And then the next page, page 11, is a tracking sheet for you as you work your business, as you get going. So um, on that sheet, the far right says make 50 calls and book 10. That just kind of gives you an idea. If you fill in all of those bubbles with phone calls to schedule appointments with women, you should end up with 10 women holding an appointment for you out of those 50 calls. Gives you a good average so you know where you're at and how you're doing. Once you do schedule an appointment from those bubbles that you're filling in to make your calls, you can then move to the top left of the page and put her booking on the correct week. So if it's week one of the month, you can write her name on the line, you know, Susie's party. And no, you have one booking for that week. Um, and continue to fill that in. And then underneath that, where it says serve by sharing the product, you can jot down the name of the women that you actually sit down with and meet about the product. And just put their name and when you met them, when you do their follow-up appointment, when you do a career chat or a listen for lip gloss, if they come as a guest, it just takes you right across the page about what you're doing with them. And this is the only sheet that I really use for my personal business tracking. I don't carry around a bunch of profile cards or tons of lists of things. I use this sheet for myself so that I know as I look back over them over the next few months who I need to follow up with, who had to reschedule her appointment, um, you know, who said that they wanted to get back with me in a month. And I just use this sheet to keep me straight and keep me organized when it comes to my client relationships, my bookings, and the phone calls and, and Facebook messages and emails that I'm sending out. So I love this tracking sheet because it keeps it simple. I'm a simple girl and I don't like too complex of things. So I put it all on one sheet so you can use that to know exactly what you're doing for your business on a monthly basis. And you can go back to review and you can use it moving ahead. Um, and you'll notice at the top of the sheet, it says our serve program. Your income is in direct proportion to how many people you serve and how well you serve them. And I really believe that that is a key to our businesses. And, um, it comes down to looking for the needs that other people have. And sometimes they may not have realized they had the need. <laughs> you know, they, they you know, didn't know much about makeup or skincare. Sometimes they're frustrated and you get a chance to really help them with something that's been bothering them for a while or anything in the middle. Um, but we serve women with a wonderful product. We serve them with a chance to feel beautiful and feel loved. We serve them with being a positive light in their day, with free product for a party, with an opportunity for their future. Any of those areas are genuine ways that we go in, we look for how we can make a difference in a positive way for her, and that brings all the results and all the success you could want in your business. And so that is why our team, Team Inspire, our motto is Empowering Abundance my heartbeat and why I do Mary Kay and why I do it would do it even if I wasn't getting paid is because it's brought into my life incredible abundance. Yes, it's been financial, but way more than that has been emotional growth. It's been a mental growth in business and in money and in time management and all of that. It's been in amazing relationships through customers and through team members and sister consultants and directors. Um, it's enriched my life in so many ways. It's empowered me to choose a more abundant life, a life that I love, a life that is thriving. And that is what I want to offer to women. Every woman I sit down with, whether it's through the product or as a part of our team, that's my desire for each of you. And so as you get started on this journey, I just want to say that all over and above, I believe if your heart is genuinely to make a difference for someone else, to be a positive blessing to her, to leave her better than she was when you first sat down in any way, um, then you've succeeded. And the results will come and the blessings will come from that. And I've seen it over and over and over again. So this sheet is a place to track how many people you're serving, and to make sure you serve them well with good follow-up and walking the process with them of building that relationship and deepening it and connecting with them. And um, the, the benefits multiply. 
especially as you go outside of just, you know, face to face to face with clients and maybe someone joined your team. Now her clients, you're touching them in a side way because you're blessing the team member and she's blessing her clients and it multiplies abundantly and the income does as well. So, um, the last few pages in our orientation packet just cover a few other details. Uh, the next page is just about how to set up a Listen for Lip Gloss. Um, your director, myself, um, will help you with that as you get going, but then um, there may come a time when you transition and you begin doing it for yourself, um, depending on your journey. Um, so this kind of gives you some simple tips for how to set those up so you can share the Mary Kay story with women that you love. Uh, then it talks about dressing for success, just a good idea, rule of thumb of how to dress for Mary Kay events. And then the next page, page 14, is a booking script. It basically talks you through how to set up an appointment with someone in your life who you know her name. If you know her name, you can, and have, you know, some connection with her, you can use this script to set up the appointment. We talk more about it later, but if you want to get ahead, totally check that out. Um, there's page 15 discusses some of the reasons why women choose to have some inventory on hand and perks and benefits. And then the last page just covers um, the benefit of building a skincare customer base and some of the potential that can be there for income and for impact on your business by doing so. So hopefully this has been helpful to just cover the basics and the details about next steps and what to be working on. And over and above, what I wanna to say to you is that I'm so excited you've decided to join our team. And I'm thrilled to walk this journey with you and I'm here for you. So please reach out. Don't hesitate. You are my job. <laughs> you are my job. And I'll match my time with your desire. But I want you to know I'm here. And um, if, if the details get heavy, just set it down and take one step at a time. If you're loving it and you want more, reach out to me and we'll go quicker. The pace is yours. The future is yours. And the impact that you can have for your life and the lives of your family and friends is pretty tremendous. And even the relationships you don't have yet. So I'm excited to see what comes out of that starter kit box for you and to journey with you every step of the way.